Hi, my name is Chris King and I'm a fly fishing guy in Northern California. I've been fly fishing for about 10 years. And one of the great things about the sport of fly fishing is that you can fly fish for every species of sport fish that there is. And one of the best species that everyone has in their back door is largemouth bass. Um, largemouth bass are f flourishing throughout all of the small ponds. Uh, maybe your local park has a walking, you know, uh, walking path around a pond and probably there's some bass in there. And it's something you can do, you know, in between your trips to Northern California or to Montana, something you can get off of work early on a Friday and, and go fish for. Um, when you're rigging up to fish for bass, one of the things that's mainly different between that and say trout fishing is that the equipment that we use is much larger. Um, for example, the flies are, are much greater in size. Typical dry fly for a trout, a size 14 dry, uh, is quite small. You can use uh, two, three, four, five weights, uh, five weight probably being the most popular for trout, uh, to cast this fly. The fly line is going to be uh, average fly line. Um, the leader taper uh, is going to be about 65% tippet, uh, depending on whether you're on a you know, real light stream like a spring creek or something like that. Um, but a typical dry fly or popping fly for bass is quite a bit larger, as you can see. And uh, we